Hey Jake with BNH, and today we have our hands on the DJI Mini 3 Pro. DJI's Mini series has been a favorite of beginners and enthusiasts who are happy to trade off some professional features for the convenience of a tiny drone. The latest iteration, however, is the first DJI Mini drone worthy of being called professional. Featuring a large 1 by 1.3 inch sensor, 4K 60p video, 48 megapixel still images, true vertical shooting, and obstacle avoidance sensors, DJI has managed to pack specs you typically find in a full-size drone into an ultra-light drone that is slightly heavier than an iPhone 13 Pro and under the weight requirements for registration with the FAA. DJI's newest 1 by 1.3 inch dual native ISO sensor is not only larger than previous mini drones, but also more sensitive in low light situations and capable of HDR video. It's truly amazing that DJI was able to fit such a large sensor into such a tiny drone. This new sensor paired with the Mini 3 Pro's 24mm f1.7 lens empowers drone photographers and videographers to capture stunning images in any scenario. As I mentioned before, the Mini 3 Pro shares many features that you find on larger, heavier drones. In addition to the large 1 by 1.3 inch sensor, the Mini 3 Pro can record 4K or HD video up to 60p and slow motion HD video up to 120p. For advanced users who want to color grade their images, the Mini 3 Pro offers D-Cine-like, which isn't as flat as a log profile, but offers just enough flexibility to add your style to the video in place of a built-in picture profile. It also has a complete set of master shots for capturing dynamic and engaging videos. The Mini 3 Pro is no slouch in photography either. Like the Mavic Air 2, it can capture 48 megapixel raw images, panoramic photos, spherical photos, and 8K hyperlapses. The Mini 3 Pro is the first consumer DJI drone with the ability to look upwards. Unlike most DJI drones, the Mini 3 Pro's gimbal supports the camera from underneath, giving the camera the range to tilt downwards 90 degrees or upwards 60 degrees. This design is great for getting low angles of tall subjects, flying underneath structures, or even just flying fast. You can aim the camera straight forward at full speed, which is comforting when approaching 35 miles per hour. While this is by no means a racing drone, it is nice to know that when you feel the need for speed, you'll still be able to see what is directly in front of you. The Mini 3 Pro is also the first of DJI's Mini drones to feature tri-directional optical avoidance sensors. The Mini 3 Pro uses forward, backward and downward facing sensors to detect obstacles around the drone just like the Mavic Air series drones. However, this time DJI placed the rear facing sensor on top of the drone. This may seem counterproductive, but repositioning the sensors on the top of the aircraft increases the sensing range when flying backwards. Combined with DJI's Advanced Pilot Assistance System 4.0, the Mini 3 Pro can detect and avoid obstacles while flying up to 22 miles per hour. In addition to adding new features, DJI has also brought back an old feature that has not been on any of the DJI's drones for some time. That's right, portrait mode. The Mini 3 Pro is the first DJI drone since the original Mavic Pro to feature a true vertical shooting mode, but it gets even better. Unlike the Mavic Pro, which was only capable of portrait photography, the Mini 3 Pro is capable of portrait photography or vertical videography at any resolution or frame rate. This is perfect for creators who want to share their content on social media platforms such as Instagram and Facebook without cropping the image. The drone is more efficient than ever before, capable of getting up to 34 minutes on the standard intelligent flight battery and a whopping 47 minutes on the intelligent flight battery plus. It's truly amazing that they can pack so much power into such a tiny drone. However, it is worth noting that the Intelligent Flight Battery Plus is heavier than the standard Intelligent Flight Battery, and this may influence performance and regulatory requirements depending on your area. For more information, visit the FAA website at faa.gov UAS in the United States or a comparable airspace authority in your region.
DJI released a new smart controller alongside the Mini 3 Pro as well. The new RC controller, like previous smart controllers, features a built-in touchscreen for controlling the DJI Fly app in a micro SD card slot for recording. At 700 nits, it is not as bright as the Mavic 3's RC Pro controller, but it is bright enough to see outdoors if you keep it out of direct sunlight. For users who prefer to use their own device for the DJI Fly app, the Mini 3 Pro is also available with the RC N1 controller or without a controller at all. The Mini 3 Pro is compatible with the same RC N1 controller used for the Mavic Air 2S and Mavic 3 series drones, enabling you to use one controller for multiple aircraft. DJI also offers a Fly More bundle that includes a complete set of extra propellers, a two-way charging hub, USB-C to USB-A cable, a shoulder bag, and a choice between two standard intelligent flight batteries or two intelligent flight battery pluses. DJI has also taken the time to add little conveniences that make the drone easier to maintain. For instance, you can charge batteries on the drone with a USB-C charger, use the two-way charger hub to charge other devices, and even use the charging hub to store up to three batteries. DJI has also improved the data transfer speed for full resolution photo and video transfers from the drone's internal memory to your RC controller or smartphone. Whether you're a beginner looking for your first drone, a professional interested in an affordable aerial camera, or an enthusiast on vacation, the DJI Mavic Mini 3 Pro has what you need to get your next big idea off the ground. Advanced safety features, superb image quality, and lightweight design help DJI's Mavic Mini 3 Pro soar above the competition while flying under the radar of current regulatory requirements for recreational use in many regions, including the United States. So are you interested in upgrading to the Mini 3 Pro? Let us know in the comments below. I'm Jake with B&H. Just keep rolling.